Welcome to Row with Controls. Here's your host, Steve Rowe. Hello everyone, Steve Rowe here. I have a great topic for this month. Let's talk about the importance of LED drivers. There's a colleague of mine that always pushes the importance of LED drivers in the world of light fixtures. And I, of course, push the importance of controls. But as we continue to see the evolution of intelligent luminaires with embedded controls, I may have to finally admit how important the LED driver is in this equation. And here's why. When most think about an LED driver, they think about various dimming protocols, whether phase dimming, zero to 10, or several digital protocols. They may think about both dimming and flip flicker performance. Perhaps they think about surge ratings and tolerance to power quality issues. These are, of course, very important considerations with LED drivers. But when I think of an LED driver and put on my controls lens, I think of one very important thing, digital connectivity. We're moving from a world where when controls and LED drivers were considered together, compatibility was the most common consideration, as there's always been the concern of the devices not working together perfectly when paired in the field. But enter digital connectivity between controls and drivers. Now the major consideration is no longer compatibility, but instead the conversation goes to the advanced features we can achieve. And when we have digitally connected controls and LED drivers, this opens up a world of possibilities. Think about the predictable performance of digital set points over the predecessor of analog signals, especially when we start getting into multifunction luminaires that have more than one handle of control with dimming, correlated color temperature, tunability, or even color control. Then there's data available from LED drivers, whether it's related to the direct current output of the LEDs, information about the input voltage, power data, runtime, etc. This data often includes fault and error indication, whether from overvoltage and current situations, temperature fluctuations, or output faults. Then three, there's the asset management aspect of the luminaire. There's often more static data, such as driver model, firmware version, day code, all of which can very, be very helpful when managing a lighting control system. The world won't move to digital, digital connectivity of this nature overnight, but this is certainly a core element of the evolution of lighting and lighting controls. So for my colleague, although I still feel controls hold the upper hand, I can acknowledge the real value of the LED driver brings to these intelligent systems. So let's call it a tie, as digital connectivity is our future. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time on Rebel with Controls. Mm -hmm.